and became the first ever female to win a K&N Pro Series race last night. Oh my God, this has to be the best day of my life right here. I don't think it gets any better than this. A huge weekend for her dad, Brian Deegan, the whole family. How many days, how many hours I put into this, how much work I've done to get to this moment. I think it answered the question that Beyonce asked, who runs the world? Girls, that's right. This is the happiest day of my life. We did it! Whoa! As you heard, our Rutledge Wood mentioned their 17-year-old Haley Deegan making history Saturday night at Idaho's Meridian Speedway, becoming the first woman to win a K&N Pro Series race. And she joins us now. Haley, I am sure this has been a long time in the making for you. What was the reaction like? We've been talking about social media on our show all night. I can't imagine what happened on your phone. Oh, no, it was crazy. Just like from immediately uh, after I got off the track, everyone was blowing up my phone and on social media, it was everywhere. It was, just, it was crazy because on the East Coast, it was already like 2 in the morning over there. Uh, I don't think I got done racing till like 11-ish. I don't know. It was pretty late till I got out of my car and got back to the pit. And once the morning hit, then it got even crazier. So I was like, it was just kind of a nonstop thing. And it was, it's almost like it, I can't even like comprehend it still. I'm still just like kind of in the moment, just like this is the best thing ever. We know that this is a sport that's dominated by men. Do you feel like you have to prove yourself as a young woman in this sport? How much is that on your mind? I think there's like a ton of different factors that come to proving myself because quite a few of the drivers out there have been there for quite a few years. Uh, some of them maybe one year, two years. Others could have been there for five, five years. It's just like there's a lot of drivers that have been there for a while, and I'm the rookie. I'm the girl. I'm one of the youngest ones out there. I think the other younger one is my teammate Derek, and I think he's only like a month younger than me. But, like, we're the youngest ones out there, and I think that I have – there's a lot of things that I want to prove to other people myself, not necessarily that people, like, expect me to prove to them. Haley, you're the first woman to win a K&N poll, the first to win a K&N race, but I understand it was a top 10 at Bakersfield that helped you get noticed that Kevin Harvick happened to be in that race earlier this year, and that really uh, was a good endorsement for you when he spoke so highly of you. Yeah, it's it's funny because, like, looking back at that Kern race, I'm like, that was nothing compared to now. Like, how much better I've gotten, how much of all the seat time has really helped me. And coming out in that first race in Kern, I was just, everything was new to me. I was learning. It was just a learning process. And just the whole, the whole race, the whole weekend, everything, I was just kind of, like, taking it all in as much as I could and learn from that and how I could get better. And we've been getting better and better each race. And... I feel like uh, the last race at Vegas, I ended up uh, getting the pole and finishing second. I was like, oh, man, the only way I can back up this one is if I win. <laughs> you know, reaction just been pouring in from all over the motorsports community. We have reaction from Kyle Busch, another prominent driver, of course. Congrats on the win. Nice work. What does that mean to you to, to see this and to have people recognize how long a road this has been for you? Yeah, like the when I woke up this morning and just like looked at my phone, seeing like Kyle Busch chasing all these belts, and it's all these like heavy hitters in the NASCAR world, whether it's racers, whether it's people off the track. Uh, it's just it's like mind blowing what uh, what winning a race can do. I feel like winning is almost the key to all success. <laughs> What are your larger aspirations, Haley? I'm sure your life has changed overnight after making these kinds of headlines, but I know there's more that you want to accomplish. Yeah, definitely. I feel like everyone's been telling me, like, oh, you've been, like, the highest finishing girl, uh, all that type stuff. But I was just kind of, like, over that. I want to prove to people that I can be the best driver, that I am going to do everything I can in my ability, and my team's going to help me out 100% so we can be the best driver out there. And we've definitely shown that this last weekend that we can be. And I just want to continue kind of keeping that ball rolling and hopefully we could bust off a couple more wins. I love hearing the excitement in your voice. I know you come from a family <laughs> of racers. They are probably thrilled for you. Thank you so much for being with us on this Sunday night and congratulations again. Yeah, thank you for having me.